Hello everyone and welcome to Food Review UK, my name is MJ and today we are reviewing the brand new fridge milkshake. This is not only the kind of new, well there's several things at play here guys. You got the redesign first and foremost with the kind of cow patchiness and the new quite bright vivid colours and the, um, the core colour of the flavour on the fridge logo. Uh, it's, it accompanies a redesign on their whole brand and also apparently a supposedly better recipe for the other flavours, they have apparently improved it. But this is actually the new flavour of the range. This is the Choco Hazelnut flavour, this is a new permanent flavour, and there is, I think, a coconut one that is a limited edition, but I haven't seen that yet. I've only found this, which was in co-op, and I found the old, but new, orange, Choc Orange, in Asda. That's all I've seen. Right, so we've got a lid that is, oh that's just, sorry, I was trying to rip the plastic off that, it's just a normal lid, but we have got a foil cap on there. If you've been watching Food Review UK for a while, you will know that actually I don't really like fridge, don't really rate them that highly at all, hashtag preview flavour. That's why, when I heard that they were doing a redesign and a new recipe for their range, I was interested, because I, I do think they are not great. Their flavour's just not there, they taste quite hollow and very low, um, just low calorie. And it ruins them, in my opinion. So, right, I'm hopeful. This is choco hazelnut flavour, so it should be Nutella. It, in my opinion, it would be hard to screw up a choc nut milkshake. Not getting a very strong nut smell. Let's go for it, guys. Ooh. Wow. That has got to be... Easily one of the best fridges I've had in a while. Easily. Up front, it actually is a very nice, quite rich, dark chocolate milkshake. And then at the end, you get the hazelnut. And it's kind of quite a natural tasting ha hazelnut. Quite earthy and not too sweet either. This actually doesn't taste like Nutella. It's interesting because it's very much a, a flavour of two halves. The flavours don't really come at the same time. Great texture as well, it's not too thick, but it's thicker than like a, like a normal kind of just flavoured milk. But a nice satisfying thinness to it as well. I'm, I'm really, really delighted. I'm so happy because Fridge are, they're such a great looking brand. I think the packaging is brilliant, even the, the last redesign that they've kind of had for only about a year, I thought was actually a really strong redesign. I've just been so disappointed with the flavours. But this one is excellent. This is probably the best one since the, honestly, probably since the chocolate fudge brownie, which is really the, the kind of only very good flavour that they've got. But now they have this one as well. It's really good. Tastes great. Way better. It doesn't taste low fat, I should say. Great consistency and a very nice, different, interesting flavour. This is not just a nut and a milkshake, which is cool. I'd give that a very solid four stars. Yep, that is very good indeed. Thank you very much for watching everyone. Are you happy, like I am, that Fridge are upping their game? Very eager to try the other flavours now and it does bode very well for the upcoming limited edition flavour. I think it's coming out in July. They're releasing a pistachio and white chocolate variety. So I will be on the lookout for that. Thanks again. Oh, actually, one thing. Why is it green? That's going to make people think it's uh, Choc Mint. I would make it like brown, like a swirled brown and light brown for chalk hazelnut. Don't know why it's green. That's a bit weird to me. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. Hope that you enjoyed it. Do check out our other channels. All of the links that you need are in the description on this video. And subscribe for more if you're new. Cheers. Hold me closer, tiny dry tart.